All right, now that I've explained how everything works on that thing, which is a little bit out of sight right now, I'm ready for my very first test drive. Of course, I'm, I know it's going to be stuck in first gear like I explained, because the uh, shift cable stuck all the way down, and it probably would shift gears at 5,000 RPM, but I'm not going to drive it that fast for its maiden voyage. So, let's fire up. It's a cold start. Come all the way over here. I've got to show you how we're firing it up. Stand there. You always have to be far enough back that you get everything in the picture. Watch. Okay, throttle. It has a gas pedal, everything now, so I'm just priming it. Oh, we uh, park. Yep. Gear shift knob is still hot because it just got done being well done. First victim, I mean passenger. <laughs> I love this big shift knob, just like driving an old tractor. Power brakes, everything's fine. If you got a spit, you can do it in the carburetor. Oops, missed. Reverse. Neutral. Try. Sweet. Oh, whoops. I forgot I turned my key off. I locked the steering. <laughs> there you go. Get a shot of everything down there, too. Now, if I put the brakes on hard, you're going to go flying out the front and I run over you. <laughs>
haven't made a way to turn it off yet. Alrighty. We need a beer, don't we? Let's go get a beer. Go beer. Thank you. Now I still have to put beer holders. I've got a big spot here. I can make a whole spot for a case. For long distance journeys, or we can fill up the whole thing and make a keg. See if we can <laughs> drive around the world on one keg of beer. 200 Canadian gallons, or imperial gallons. <laughs> That'd take a lot of beer. What part of this vehicle did you help make? Nothing. Nothing? What part did you learn? A lot. Not to get anything. tanked when you're building a tanker? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's for sure. You need to have a lot of brain power to build something like yeah. that. Yeah, I maybe have to put the airbag back in. Oh, it's even got tilt. Sweet. Yep, I have to put armrests with beer holders too. We can go on some serious journeys, and then we can take the beer out of here and fill it with gas and go one tank around the world on, you know, drive a vehicle around the world on one tank of gas. <laughs> you probably could with this thing. Just like Bert Rattan did and Jean Laguerre way back tw over 20 years ago with that Varies or some sort of home-built airplane they made. They went around the world on one tank of gas. Wow. Yeah. I bought one of their planes, but it burned up in my barn fire. I bought a quickie. I met those guys when I was in Mojave, California.